What's up, guys? Alright. Uh, my last recording, which I just finished up, <clears throat> and it's actually publishing now. Uh, I finished up not maybe 20 minutes ago. I don't really want to play it on it currently. I did a few Ryujin quests, got that uploaded so you guys could see that if you wanted to keep following along with it. Um, but I'm gonna go back to the, uh, our Let's Play. So we're gonna get ready, ready to do that. Maybe another hour or so of that. Uh, yes. Maybe another hour or so of the Let's Play. And, uh, yeah. I hope That's you are best. satisfied with the quarters available to you. Yeah. So... Are you ready to get to work? Or was there something else? Ah, yeah. Okay, so... Goodbye. Uh, in our... Where we left off at last time, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, well, we finished up the I first one or two main captain. story quests. And we got here to the lodge for the first time. Uh, talked to Sarah. Turned in our artifact we brought from the mining company. And, uh, yeah, so that's where we're at. Not too far ahead. Like, new first video. I mean pretty self-explanatory it's the first hour so we're about an hour into the game I am at uh, yeah, your service captain whenever you're up for it we have work to do we're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work the artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock that means people can pass them around not even knowing what they are I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects get back a lot of noise usually but a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. Felt the same way when I started, too. There's an electricity in the air when you know you're about to uncover something. But it's not just that. I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself, and for you to learn more about us. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. We'll need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before, or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Every member of Constellation is their own conscience. Understood? Good. Let's take a little stroll through New Atlantis, shall we? Yeah, so she says that. She says that, oh, everyone's their own person. We don't care what you were before, whatever. I trust man. you're still satisfied. If you do anything with bad do with any of these no companions and uh, follow you, Sarah. they will hate I've your fucking never regretted guts. This decision. They will I'm not like it. you at all. You could have done just about anything. So, yeah. So, it's important to me that you feel valued here. It's not always easy, but I just remind myself that if it weren't for you and for Constellation, I'd have no idea that any of this was going on. Ever since I got here, this has felt like home. These people are family. I hope it feels that way for you too. All right. So let's figure out about see your parents at Pioneer Tower. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I can go see my mom and dad. Mom and Poppy. Uh, mission talk. What does it say? Talk to Sarah's contact. Second. Okay. Alright, so let's go ahead and start running. You see that scientist out in front of Mast? Staring at trees? Sounds upset? Whatever it is. Can't be that bad, right? Hunt for the scientist by a tree. I hope this oh, water way. doesn't contain anything harmful. Or you live here. Why why would you how would you not know? The best of your abilities. And to uphold the values of the Vanguard. Honor, loyalty, self-reliance in no, all your think... actions as members of the United Colonies Navy. I, I do. do. Then I'm proud to welcome you to the Vanguard. Now, you all have your assignments? Get out there and show them what the UC is made of. Supra et ultra. 
Panther. You look like if you're looking to earn yourself a place in the UC, Commander Tuala can get you squared away. There we go. Yeah, I figured that would give me a quest to go join. Sip. Ah, uh, another space explorer. Hey, you ever think of joining up with the Vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? Excellent. Just need to do a little paperwork. Do well. You'll be out there keeping the peace in no time. Ah, I don't need to skip through all Don't this forget, stuff. John. I need him back after you wrap him in that fancy get-up of yours. No worry, Sarah. I'm not forgetting about you or our little business afterwards. Promise. First things first, head down to the orientation hall and get signed up at the registration terminal. System will walk you through the rest. Oh, and if you got a bounty? Well, you're gonna have to make things right with the UC before we'll let you join. But if you've got any questions, I can get you sorted. Something wrong with the exam? Right. Got so wound up bringing you on board, I almost forgot. No, oh, I haven't. Come on, John. Let's hear it, before you try to convince him to join the Marines. All right. Here's what I've got. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system? Which Admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. Soul system is a lot of planets, but a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. Anything for Sarah. UC always takes care of its own. Even the prodigal children. Oh, brother. Sidonia, so we gotta go to Sidonia. Which works with me. Super Ed Ultra. I've never actually done the UC quest line. But we're here for the main quest for now. We're ready to launch. You are entering United Colony space. Yeah, I know. Maintain course and prepare to be scanned. And we're done. Enjoy Sidonia. Enjoy Sidonia. Alright, cool. Land. explain the brownouts. So, what's this going to run? If there are no other surprises, mid five figures. Five figures? Five? Fine. Do it. I'll be at the bar. Find me when it's done. We're on it, sir. Man, he would just sound like a serious problem. Though I don't think your ship can get uh, infested, though it'd be kind of neat if it could. <laughs> I've never actually taken the time to see if this uh this place is in a dome or anything. Well I'm still flying pretty high. Keep a look Ah, oh, the annoying fan's fire gonna fire be here, yeah. Yes. What do you mean there's no work? Yeah, do you have any idea how far we've traveled? How much money we've spent? Look at this place. I can't imagine being cramped down here, choking on the fumes and the dust. No trees, no grass. It's depressing. Two months for a job that may not even exist then. 
Hey, hey, I get it. But there's nothing I can do. It's out of my hands. You can take it up with corporate if you want. Sorry, but I have to get back to work. Come on, forget it. Let's get out of here. Maybe it's not Finding too late to fair catch a word, right back. I take it all so <laughs> seriously, I always tell my mates. They're pulling Screw rocks out of the ground, not building spaceships. I know you Welcome, welcome. Nice to meet you. Name's Trevor. Mining director for the Deimos Mining Project here in scenic underground Sidonia. I could spare a minute or two to chat. So long as you're not looking for mining work, I suppose. Argos, huh? Yeah, I've heard of them. That's great. But, yeah, unfortunately, all our mining contracts are filled right now. Unless... Maybe you could help me out with a job. Off the books. Great! I promise it's nothing that'll get anyone in any kind of trouble. See, you might have noticed that our equipment ain't exactly holding together like it used to. Problem is, we can't get new equipment unless we start exceeding our quotas. And we can't do that until we get new equipment. A real dilemma, right? I've got a plan for solving our little problem, though. Okay, glad you're still on board. First, I need someone from the outside to bolster our yields so we can prove that we can exceed our quota. I'll fill you in on the rest of the details after you've hauled up some more. One standard quota should do. I need to know I can trust you with the easy stuff first. Alright. When you've got enough, drop it off in the bin over there for processing. Then come see me. Alright, me. I could use a break. There's a guy. This guy. Ah, I hey, didn't talk to good him. Good to see you. Oh, <laughs> hello there, friend. Have you been there long? Oh, good. I thought maybe I'd fallen asleep. But, oh my, I've forgotten my manners. Phil Hill, at your service. Yes, it rhymes. My parents had a thing about rhyming. My siblings are named Bill, Jill, and Sill. The Hills. <laughs> what a thrill. But there I go again. You aren't here to talk about me. You're here to talk about List. Sounds like we're about to hear a sales pitch. Great! What can the League of Independent Settlers do for you today? Or, as I like to say, how can I help make today your very best day? That's terrific! Because I have a lot of work needing doing. This stack of papers here, these are just the most recent applicants looking for new worlds to settle on. Everywhere I go, people are really excited about the prospects of living a truly free life, living where and how they want to. I've got a cargo hold full of stacks just like that. <laughs> oh boy. That's not our problem. Oh, of course not. I, I wouldn't make you do my paperwork for me. Although, I, w I wouldn't mind the help. Fantastic! That's exactly the can-do helpful attitude that List looks for in all its employees and contractors. We're looking for folks with ships like and or basic like people guy. skills to seek out suitable planets and leads on potential clients. I don't suppose you possess either of those qualifications? You know, I can tell that you do, just by the little we've interacted already. Most importantly, we need to collect data on habitable planets. The more habitable, the better. <laughs> you know, that oxygen and water are musts. Other signs of life, even better. Secondly, we're always looking for new applicants. So, as you travel around meeting people, when the occasion arises, see if you can interest them in signing up for the list. I'm pretty sure I overheard some people in here talking about wanting to start a new life. Why don't you start with them? Excellent! Thank you for any assistance you can lend us. Whoops! <laughs> Nearly forgot. <laughs> Take this! Alright. Okay. Keep it simple. Hello. Keep to yourself. Anyway, what's your poison? Oh, wait. You ain't been around. One off on patrol, hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think it might be time to pour one out to the blackest sea. Ah, oh, believe me, I've heard it. 
After about round three or four was all he would talk about. And he's got a voice that carries. Look, nothing more I'd love than to help out a fellow Martian. Especially one that's missing. But... <clears throat> He has a tab, and you don't know if he's coming back. It's a lot of credits, okay? I let it slide for a long time because he's a regular, but... If I'm out all that money, I got problems. What do you say? I don't know, dude. That's kind of a, 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 a dickish move, you know what I'm saying? No, I've done this routine. Let's skip to the part where you admit you're lying about what he owes. You calling me a liar? I'll throw both of you out of this bar right now. Oh, please. Two strangers arrive from Offworld asking for information only you have. You see an opportunity. Everyone always does. Lower the price. Don't think we can't find another way to get what we want. Fine. Come on. Life on Sidonia ain't hard enough. You gonna guilt trip me? Hell yeah, it is. Uh, I want oh, that worked. I do. All right, I give up. Just trying to earn a living here. Last time he was here, Moera kept yelling about the Lady of Love, <laughs> singing songs, all that kind of thing. Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? Oh, fine. We'll make do. All right, so we gotta go find this guy. Go to Venus. Yeah, we gotta go find this guy. He's got the artifact that we need. Uh, if you haven't seen my other video, yeah, I've already beaten the game. I'm more, I've actually new game plus two times, so I'm my third game so far. And uh, yeah, it's, I mean, it's fun. So I already know most of all this dialogue and everything, so I'm trying not to skip or talk through it so you guys can follow along. But if I, I sometimes accidentally catch myself spamming a, you know, to go through the dialogue, and I, I sorry about that. I, I try to limit that as much as I can, but it's just a habit. I don't know why I ran all the way to my ship when I could just do this. Venus. Oh, looks like we better be fighting. Hello. What do we have here? See that cluster of ships? Varun Zealots. You ever run into one? <laughs> Completely devoted to a deity they call the Great Serpent. The Devourer of the Unbelievers. I'll let you guess what happens if they spot us. No, but I think I see something else that might. There's a UC satellite beacon hovering distressingly close to those Varun ships. If we can get close enough to it, we could download its logs and figure out where our vanguard was heading to next. Exactly. Minimal ship power. Go slow. We grab the data on that satellite and jump away. Yeah, I don't know exactly. That he jumped from the soul system out into the beyond and touched your right, magnificence. That he learned the truth of the shrouding, the coming eternal embrace. Hoping they don't spot me. That you will reward the promised and cast the accursed into shadow. Hopefully they don't spot me. I'm going a lot quicker than I did my first time, because my first time I just creeped literally all the way there because I was nervous. Hey, there we go. To all UC affiliated ships, I'm heading to the Nova Galactic Star Yard orbiting Earth's moon. Yeah, yeah, I know. The whole place is decommissioned. But I need parts for emergency repairs. Hopefully it hasn't been picked clean yet. Oh, that's not good. Earth and everything around it was abandoned a long time ago. And the old star yards are crawling with spacers and other scavengers. Alright, so. The old neighborhood. We need to go to. 
Nova Galactic Star Park. Look how this dude's life's at risk, and we, we dead ass don't give a shit. We want to go walk on that moon, my boy. Alright. Wait, it's dark. Oh yeah, so, uh, if you guys didn't know this already, uh, when you're playing this game, if you go and you turn your gameplay all the way up to very hard, I don't play on it so I can risk, not risk raging, and then board or, you know, go through the door or whatever, hit that loading screen, and then you go back, change the gameplay back to wherever you were playing on, all the loot spawns will be based on the very hard difficulty or the Two difficulty you made or you set the game at. Uh, okay. You walked into it's not Vanguard Moara. But the enemy will like go back now to normal where scavenging you around here and someone else came and after you said hello. So if you want easy oh, loot, better chance at high crew. loot. They uh, pillage abandoned facilities shot. and shoot anyone who gets in their way. They're even less organized than the Crimson Fleet. Just countless desperate groups scavenging and killing to survive. I hate to know what I did in my last, uh, or in my main playthrough. Class rated Grendel Solstice Rower. Eh, we'll go with it. Anyone know the oopsie I made is that uh, I set it to very hard walking through there, came through here, so now the spawns are gonna be at normal, which is, uh, I'm just a dummy for doing that. So yeah, the spawns in here are going to be normal, don't pay attention to them. I didn't play that right, I didn't expect them to be too good. Hey, what up? I gotta reload. Let's do this. Can't concentrate. Oh man. Covered fire. real quick what do we pick up anti-personnel coachman we'll take that as a shotgun that can be useful Rindle lacerate semi-automatic yeah that's what it is modified and modified maelstrom 
side star. Okay. All right. We're gonna go through. That's a lot of red dots, man. There's got to be a computer that accesses like some turrets or something. No. Hey, bro, you run up here kind of hella fast, ain't you? Okay, well, that was absolutely idiotic of me. I threw it there and it blew up. And then I thought, hey, you know, it would be a great idea is to throw another one there again. That's, that is just incredible. Alright, let's try and speed. Gonna bury you! Ah, I'm on a roll. That's bulletproof nothing, glass. Nothing. I wish that, like, whatever side you started to first, the other side would be like, alright, he's helping. Let's not fuck him up. Searching them, make it quick. Yes, I am. I need medicine and I need a uh, you know, ammo and shit like that. My wood nice or something. Nice. Body bags, that's cool. Alright. Let's go up in here, see what they got. Doesn't really look like they have much. Yeah, I don't really see much going on this way. I'll take that, I like books. Spacer. Besides that last one. All right. Yeah. No. I mean, this game. Uh, I've really been enjoying this game so far. I mean, honestly, it's one of the better games I've played in the past few years. I just haven't really been too excited about video games recently. Uh, but this coming out kind of reignited stuff. I'm up late again playing it. You know, um, sacrificing sleep, <laughs> trying to get this stuff done. Uh, I started a YouTube channel, well I mean I started my YouTube channel a while ago, I just didn't upload anything on it at all until, why do I not have a space on it, what the fuck, uh, I just didn't upload anything on it at all, oh yeah I have it in hide helmet and breathable environment, so that's right, but anyways I didn't upload anything on it at all just cause I wasn't, I mean it just wasn't anything interesting to me, but I played this a little bit, played it a few times, and I was like, yeah, this is this, I could definitely see myself, you know, making, enjoying it enough to do something like that, so that's what we're doing. 
if you the, the, the let's play this is more of a slower style of, of play because we're going through the quest the story trying to figure stuff out carrying enough clutter you. there or should we find some more I don't know must be over in Cumberland yeah but uh my shenanigans videos that's the ones where I've, I've done everything that you know or I haven't done everything I've, I've played the game and new game plus and everything like that so we're able to uh do a lot more stuff more quickly. I don't have to sit through the cutscenes and do the, you know, listen to the dialogue and stuff like that. I can just go straight to taking people out. Uh, it sounds like Sarah's having fun. My friend is how we do things. Damn, I'll take it. It's only at 29 damage resistance, though. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't feel like taking it. This one's giving me ballistic damage resistance, anyways. Crippling Grendel. See that door open automatically, man. Alright, what's going on? Hey, I'm still over encumbered, Sarah. I may need to dump some shit off on you. Sarah, come here. We still need to find any have something for me? Yeah, categories weapons. Alright. Um what can I give her that would be better? Let me give her Ah, oh, the modified Grendel. It takes 777, so I'd have to give her one of those. Seven 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 caseless. Go ahead and give her five just to be safe. Packs, give her all these. Bye-bye. All right, what am I, what's my mess at? 135, that's doing good. Oh, wait, I gotta go over to her and Old actually make Old Star Yacht, if you have any gear, you... There we go. So long. Why did that disappear? Oh, oh, because it's not in that corpse. Mm. Not leaving anything behind, Sarah. Do not worry. That's why you carry in uh, a good decent amount of shit. Ah, it scared the shit out of me. Did you hear that? Did I hear what, bro? Don't let him get away! It's all up in here. Doesn't really look like there's much. Hey, it chumps me. Nice.
go. Doesn't seem like it goes anywhere. I got some crackling in my headset. Don't know what that's all about. destroying one of their ships than fighting them all at once here. to go to Neptune. We definitely need a better ship. The Frontier, the I mean it's a nice name. Sounds dope. But uh just not Wait till you see that. After playing a little There's bit a ship it's just not drifting that great. out there. No time to take in the sights. That could be our vanguard. Where are we heading off to? Oh, right there. Something's wrong. The ship's weapons are powering up. Get ready! Oh, I got it. I got it. There we go. Vanguard to civilian ship. Come in. If you stop shooting at us, we'd be more than happy to respond. It's not me. Mercs hijacked my ship. Wiped find a couple of them, but they have locked me down. Really could use an assist. We blow that ship out of the stars. He's dead and our artifact's gone. We're going to have to board. Target the engines. Once they stall out, we'll have our jump. Do I have the skill necessary to target? Targeting control systems. That's it. Start the docking routine. Come on. Let's go rescue that vanguard. I don't suppose long. I have time for a nap All before right. we leave. Hmm? Nah, you're the one over here best for me about making making it quit.
can, dude. Am I glad to meet whoever you two are? Looks like we're all in one piece. Any day you walk away from, right? What? You guys still exist? Man, I've only heard stories. We've heard stories too. About a strange object you found on patrol. So, you know what that thing is. I tried to hawk it in Sidonia, and the guy thought I was peddling phony titanium. Mm, it doesn't play nice with scanners. It'd be worthless to someone trying to flip rare minerals quickly. So you're saying I shouldn't be using it as a hood ornament? Hey, sorry. I just didn't know what it was. But I guess that's what you all are for, right? Here, happy to trade a novelty for a rescue any day. Let's grab the artifact. Let's go ahead and grab this vision time. Good work. Yeah. Let's get back to the lodge. Hey, I feel like I can take shit. I, I, damn. I don't need that though. That's a glitch that I ain't seen in a minute. Take it back to the lodge. Awesome. Let's go ahead and run all the way back there. And then I think uh, I may go and let's start up the UC Vanguard. Hope you are satisfied with the corners <laughs> available to you. Go ahead. It fits. Energy spiked a bit, but it's restabilized. Is there anything new showing up? No, it's the same as before. There's a massive output as the artifact is added, then it harmonizes. Like it's waiting for the others. Hmm, that's speculation, but I think you're right. We need more. Here. You've earned this. Welcome to Constellation. As a full member this time. We're going to do great things together. All of us. By the way, how would you like to keep traveling together? I'm not sitting behind my desk for this. These artifacts are a new chapter for Constellation, and I'm going to be out there for it. And I want you out there as well. You got results. <laughs> I need someone like you watching my back. Sure, let's do it. All right. We've got a few more leads we should talk about. First, there's an expedition that Sam Co has been putting together. It's in Free Star Collective Space, and he knows it inside and out. There's also the Eye, our star station in orbit. About time for you to meet Vladimir. He's been hard at work tracking down more anomalies. And last but not least, Noel. Have we heard anything from Barrett yet? A courier from Argos Extractors came by to let us know they're packing up the operation on Vectera. But that's it. No other word. Mm, that's not good. We should get over there and check on Barrett in person. Bring me anything you... See, am I over-encumbered? No, I'm not over-encumbered. What? Oh, wait, no, that's her. I am over-encumbered. Alright, so we're going to give her... Constantly, man, that has better than mine. Go ahead and give her all that. I got returned to Victoria. Oh, yeah, I got Talk to you that. later. Barely. I hope you are satisfied with the My orders God. of it. And then call it right after that one. The end of the second part of the Let's Play. 
Uh, like I said, this is just mainly for the story, for the quest, let you guys see what it's like. And then after we kind of get, once everyone gets experience with it, with me and everything, then I think we'll, uh, we can move on. Sergeant Yumi's looking for a reliable More people to help the guard. More character. Contact but for now, him if you're interested. We'd all plan. appreciate it. My shenanigans character, which is my main character, he'll be, uh, he'll be the one doing most of, uh, the exploring and everything if you want to see something different. Set course to Victera. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go get Barrett. Remember, it appears things have gone downhill since the last time you were here. Yeah, you Argos has clearly well, washed its back. hands of this operation. <laughs> Oh no, don't <clears throat> start. I've had enough Barrett for one lifetime. I don't need the sequel showing up on my doorstep. More pirates showed up when you were gone. We weren't as lucky this time. Calvert, Troy, some of the new Dusties, they didn't make it. Well, how could you have? You weren't here. Anyway, I was pinned down behind some crates with Barrett. Bullets and laser fire everywhere. No smile on that damn carefree face of his. Like he knew this was it. I started stealing myself to go out fighting. Then that idiot puts his hand on my shoulder and says, Stay here, Lin. I got you. Not quite. Barrett is more dangerous than you might think. Next thing I know, Two of the pirates are dead, and he's got the third one in a headlock. Drags him out into the open at gunpoint and demands to talk, or else I'm going to demonstrate Newton's third law on this guy's temporal lobe. And that's when they brought out Hella. <sighs> I didn't overhear everything, but after the ten longest seconds of my life, Barrett put his hands up, and both of them ended up getting taken aboard the pirate ship. And that's the last I saw of either of them. They could have grav jumped anywhere. I tried pinging a transmission to the ship in the comms building before they left, but the pirates must have fried it. You want to try it? Go ahead. But the odds of them being alive, even if you could find them. <sighs> I've lost a lot of people on this run, Dusty. I just want to pack up. Alright, we gotta fix the comms computer. That's a fairly de easy task. Just run over here. Map. I take useless shit all the time for no reason. Now, I probably won't even get around to much of the crashing or outposts anytime soon, so I don't know why I keep grabbing the junk. I got a few outposts going on my main, but that's really something, I'll take that, that's really something, uh, because I think you need that, that's really something you do, though, I mean, you can do it anytime, but if you're wanting to explore, do whatever, the game's kind of mainly meant for you to play through the story, do that, and a new game plus it, and then do everything you want to do after that. Which, honestly, I kind of like. I really like, actually. The New Game Plus, legitimately, this game feels more like a continuation of the game itself rather than just a reset of it entirely. You lose everything except for uh, your skills and your and, and other stuff. I almost spoiled some of the game. Uh, I can bring it up when we get to that point, though. But you lose your skills... Or you don't lose your skills, but you lose your items and all your creds, except for like 15 to 20,000, somewhere around there. And they give you a new, they give you a spaceship and a stars, uh, a spaceship and a, uh, a spacesuit to start the new game plus with. So I mean, it's not all set up. I mean, it's, it's, you honestly can get the stuff back fairly quickly. Uh, just do a few missions, get a few creds, and then. Uh, you can easily just buy a lot of the shit back. But honestly, loot drops in this game are, are pretty common, pretty fair and uh, decent, especially if you turn the game to hard, then 
walk into uh, somewhere and then change it back to normal or whatever you play on after you uh, go to the loading screen. Then it, I mean, then it's super easy. But even without it, yeah, you st still get a lot of loot. I need to find those emergency power supplies, and I know I do. I just don't know where to find all of them. No power cell. Usually, though, it gives you the quest. Like, it'll give you a, uh... Oh. I guess I gotta go in there. I gotta do this first. Ooh. There we go. Haven't seen a lock picked that easily since I traveled with Vladimir Sol. Dope, we already got one of them in there. Now we just need to go find the other two. One of them's outside. The other one's in the other thing, I believe. Yeah. We'll go run over here, grab it. Oh, wait, Lynn has one of them. I you wanna try fixing them? Don't see what good it will do since yeah. they're already gone, but fine. Here. You need any more? Feel free to scavenge around. Alright. Let me run over here. Click that. Looks Emergency powers. Medbed. I don't really remember that one. Oh, you can go. Oh, yeah, this is the mine. Can I actually go down it again? That would be cool. I feel like wasting time. over encumbered? Yes, I am. Wow. That's not too crazy a deal, but okay. Let's run over here. Boop, 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 boop. jump calculations before we're out of range. Out of range of what? Out of range of the sensor array on Vectera. Did you keep up? Once we're outside the start, the bandwidth goes from instant to I actually never. What good is sending a transmission down there? You gonna tell Lynn how royally screwed we both are? She doesn't even have a ship. You underestimate how many of my admirers there are in the galaxy, Heller. One of them is bound to show up, looking to reunite with this handsome face. We're doomed. Capital D, doomed. Got it, okay. Whoever finds this, I'm attaching the interstellar coordinates to the metadata on the transmission. Rescue us. Repeat. Rescue us. So, you actually get that computer working again? What? Let me see that. <laughs> Funny. Even knowing he's alive, I still never want to see him again. <laughs> Hella, on the other hand... Okay. Let me send you the location data embedded in the transmission. Find them, okay? Be a while before Argos comes to pick me up. I'll be here if you need me. And hey, if you ever need a little extra help, 
I've been thinking about a career change lately. Maybe it's time to put Argos behind me. Maybe it is, Lynn. Seems like you've been keeping busy, Dusty. If, uh, you find yourself in need of a capable traveling companion, we should talk. My contract's up with Argos, and I could use a change of scenery. Works for me. I All right, we're gonna put her on the frontier. For her, we're gonna assign her to the frontier, but she's following me, right. so I think she'll just end up staying with me. Lynn will go to the frontier. She'll be on there whenever we you have her. Got something for yeah, me? yeah, she's Bye still for following. Now. Back to Victera. Let's go ahead and jump to where we need to go. Man, that's just spinning like crazy. Alright, go ahead and open up the planet map. We're gonna scan it while we're here. Crashed ship. That's an evil screen. We're loading screen. Using my loading screens are not this long. I usually they're like, I don't know, half a second. What's going Touching on? Touching down. There we go. One thing I I will always probably complain about in this game is that like yeah I get it the plan the planets you know most planets are gonna be barren they're gonna probably look similar to this you know we in the future we may have gone and put some structures up on a few of them but for the most part yeah they're gonna look like this. However, let me ride my fucking ship around. All right, because running across, you know, 500 meters of this can be boring sometimes. Or well, it gets boring sometimes. Where is she landing? Where are you landing at, man? Oh, man, you landed right over there about where I need to be. Sorry, Heather, we'll come and save you in just a second. <sighs> That's gonna take a little bit more time. Uh, we're just gonna get Heller for now. We'll, fo we'll get another ship sometime. I know how to get a pretty decent one. Alright. Oh, hey, it's you. And here I thought you were some pirate coming back to kill me. Lucky me, right? Nah, nah, I'll, I'll be alright. Just, you know, wasn't trying to move around too much with all the painkillers and nausea meds running through me. Man, I was so terrified when I got pulled on board that pirate ship. There it was all. Sorry, brother, I'll get us out of this. Trust me. Yeah. I'm starting to see that. He tells me we need to start pretending to fight each other. <laughs> Trick the pirates into thinking they need to come in before one of us gets killed. I just remember him shouting, this kid is a killer. How am I supposed to defend myself against these pearly whites? He's gonna bite my face off. I mean, I didn't think it would work, but they came in. All of a sudden, we were wrestling with two of them. Barrett reached for one of their guns. Bingo. Blasted the pilot right in the back. <laughs> Through to the flight console. And dropped orbit like a rock off a high rise. <sighs> I blacked out. And when I came to, there he was, smiling. Like it was just another day on the job. 
You miss the fun part, Heller. <laughs> I mean, I go through all the trouble of saving your butt, and you weren't even awake to notice. Then he did the little finger gun thing. <laughs> Well, no, I don't think so. I caught him holding his ribs a few times. <laughs> Favorite his left leg a bit, you know? Oh, yeah. Probably should have talked about that first. <laughs> Did I mention I'm on a lot of painkillers? <laughs> so, I was real excited when a ship showed up. <laughs> then, less excited when I realized it was a crimson fleet ship. And then, really, really less excited when Barrett said, It's okay, I got this. He mumbled something to him, and then they were all gone. I was drifting in and out, but... Yeah, I think so. Got a signal from the ship before they grab jumped. Guessing it was Barrett. <laughs> Haven't really been in a good <clears throat> space to have a listen. <sighs> Here you go. Hey, uh, uh, I should come with you, right? I don't think anyone else is coming. <laughs> I didn't realize you could actually tell him to stay here. You come get him later. That's kind of that's kind of fucked. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, let's get. Yeah, <laughs> just uh. Don't ask me to operate any heavy machinery for a while. Ugh, give me yeah, a minute. I think the worst of it is... Yeah, I'll be alright. I'll be alright. Ready to wisecrack with the best of them. Let me know when you want to head out. I don't know why. He reminds me of uh, Ryan Reynolds for some reason. Kind of looks like him, I think. Maybe just a little bit. I mean, maybe it's just me, but... Alright, dude. Still think there might be a spot for me on your ship? <laughs> I gotta get off this rock. Yeah, dude, come on. Whew, oh, I'm glad to hear you say that. For a second there, I thought you were gonna leave. All right, so he's gonna go to the ship, yeah. You got it. And that's kind of how you, on you the build flip a side, boss. You can do it with companions like these. Uh, story companion, you can do it with the companions at the constellation like Sarah. Uh, there's a girl you're gonna meet later named uh, Andrea. Who else? Sam and Barrett, you can make them all your crew, you can, they can all be on your ship at the same time. It's pretty neat, but only one of them can be your active follower, like Sarah here, follow me around on planets and stuff. So, I mean, it's cool, I like the way they did it, and, I mean, the neat thing is, like, say you have an active follower and you got, like, five crew members, then you can just, and you want to switch out followers, well, you just take your follower, tell her to wait on your ship, and assign her to your ship, or him, and then, uh... Oh, I gotta listen to that permission. And then, after you do that, just go and ask someone else to follow you. And you just swap out crew members who uh, follow you. It's a... I've been doing it on my other one for a little bit. Alright, uh, where are we at? Oh, wait, it wouldn't be there. It'd be in notes. Can't believe we got into this mess! You've given the fleet a lot of trouble, Barrett. Hey, since when is surviving being attacked causing trouble? Isn't that just fighting back? Hey, pilot, could you move your arm a little bit to the left? I can't make out the console. Don't move. He's trying to figure out our destination. Probably transmitting this conversation right now while we're still in orbit. Well, yeah. Thought I was making that pretty obvious. Okay, okay, put the gun down. I'm done. See? My retinas are pointing away from the console and towards this lovely view of space we have out the window. Tie him up. Once we get back to the base, the fun starts. After you cap. Who that is? Bounty hunter cap. Oh, I chose one of them. Thing. You're a tough one to track down.
Now you can pay them, and you have a few more dialogue options. I'm gonna ask, I never asked this one. Okay. So if you say that, I know they attack you instantly. If you say you can try, you can pay them. I don't like paying them. I'm just gonna say you can try. So either of those two dialogues, they immediately uh, attack you. I had one at one point that actually allowed me to uh, attempt to persuade them not to, and it actually worked. They didn't attack me. Uh, I think part of the whole... Ah, jeez, it was messed up. Okay, so we got we got destroyed. All right. Well, I'll tell you what we'll do. Video, oh man, the video is going on a little long, so we're definitely gonna go get this one for sure. I didn't mean to do that. Oh really? I gotta do that again? That was my last save. I gotta run all the way back over. Wow, that's annoying. So when we get over there, we're gonna skip through all that dialogue. I just want everyone to know. Ah, that's frustrating. Try not to make this one so long, but it may be an hour and a half video. But the Let's Plays usually are uh, running a little bit longer. Oh, hey. Yeah, skipping through all this. Nah. Man, there it. He tells me, I just, I mean, bingo. Uh, I, you miss the man. Oh, yeah. So, and then I was drifting and got a signal. Uh, hey. Yeah. Uh, give me a minute. Let me know when you want to. All right, cool. Now we're going to talk to him, get him to become our crew member. Still think there might be. Yeah, um, you got right, it. Everyone's on the ship. We are saving. Oh, it's auto saving. Are you gonna auto save before? Oh yeah, I gotta listen to that thing again. They're dead. Oh, wrong one. You've given the fleet a lot of trouble, Baron. Yeah, we are listening to that. So. Hey. Since when is surviving being attacked causing trouble? I didn't mean to do that. Hey, pilot. Could you move your arm a little bit to the left? I can't make out the console. Don't move! He's trying to figure out our destination. Probably yeah, doesn't look like the bounty hunter spawn this time, which is fine with me. Landing initiated. Watch your flaring. Well, okay, as soon as we yeah, there, as soon I was making that pretty line. obvious. As soon as we that, uh, okay, 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 put the gun down. But, I'm done. See? My retinas are pointing away from yeah, the Yeah, uh, I really appreciate anyone who is here actually watching through these long, long-ass videos. I know it's a lot. Time up. Once we get back to the base, the fun starts. I know I'm quick saying a lot, but that last experience just annoyed at this uh, Ah, grab it. Hi. Yeah, my boy. Fuck, I thought I just came out of this way. Oh. 
tell you, don't get high like that. Had enough. Yeah, you did, my boy. I'm over encumbered. Oh, that's, Not gonna that's last much longer. <laughs> I uh I didn't mean to melee her. I'm used to my melee and my crouching. Uh, or melee and everything being opposite. Yeah, melee and crouch being opposite. B is usually my melee. While my crouch is in the uh, I can't see right stage. She can't see, but Oh, I got 23 minute packs. Okay, that's a lot more comfort. And we'll see. Uh, I don't really. Let's go see how much this will do. I'm taking Damn, you down! Damn, go side. Choice. Inventory packs, boo boo. Helmets. Boo. 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 I'll keep both of those on me, why not? Alright, now we turn around and we're not worrying about our health and being. Ah, it's just the gravity is just terrible in this one. Alright. Oh yeah. There's no certainty to the universe at all. Once you really start getting out there, the laws of physics kind of turn into suggestion. Holy shit. You actually found me. I wish I could say this is the first time this has happened with Barrett, but well, it isn't. Well, this is turning into a regular constellation party, isn't it? I should have bought drinks. You know, it's actually been kind of nice. Matsura the Grim here is a great host. No sense letting people's last moments be unpleasant. See, that's what I like I about you, Matsura. Like Real renaissance man. I have enjoyed our time together, Barrett. But I can't just let you go with nothing to show for it. Is Constellation willing to pay ransom in exchange for this man's freedom? You want me to end all this with nothing to show for it? He does seem to be unusually skilled in that area. He has been more entertaining than most hostages. Barrett has some good friends, it seems. Very well. You're all free to go. It's been a real pleasure, Matsura. Really. And good luck out there with all the, you know, hurting people and taking their money. <laughs> Alright, so, uh... He's free to go. I played the pirate. I do not you encourage know. you to return. Oh, you don't encourage I'm me to return to see you. that? It just makes me want to do it even more. Bashing coat. Let's go ahead and throw that on there. 
I don't care. I played a pirate playthrough on one of my new game pluses. I don't care. Alright. That was much easier than I imagined. <laughs> Take that, that, that sniper space suit. I mean, that's pretty neat. I mean, I'll take it. Modified Maelstrom, I'll take that. Didn't really have anything, but I didn't really want to let him live. I let him live in my first one. Yeah. Delgado's directive. I mean, I know who Delgado is. systems just like we talked about. Do not stop. Free Star Collective, United Colonies, they think the galaxy is theirs. They are wrong. It belongs to the free people of the Crimson Fleet. It always has. We are just reclaiming what is rightfully ours. And we will use their own selfishness and arrogance. Oh, I didn't... Yeah, it didn't keep going through. Well, that kind of sucks. Notes. They build facilities go. all over. Facilities that are still there, intact and abandoned. Just waiting for someone to come in the and set up shop. That someone its is the Crimson Fleet. So go! Make yourselves at home and bring the fight right to their goddamn doorsteps! I don't need any of this right now. Alright, so now our objective is returned to the lodge. Okay, yeah, so we're gonna do this and then we're going to go ahead and call it for that because, uh. You know, that. I think that'll be good for the let's play. The video would be plenty long enough. And, um. I may continue to play a little bit more on my main character, my shenanigans character, but I'm, I'm probably going to be building outposts, so I may not, probably won't record that and post that, that's a bit, I mean, that's a bit tedious of a process, it can be, and it's I wonder if any discovery reports have come in while we were away. I at your service, Captain. What's up, Got a little held up on Vectera. Barrett, we were worried sick. Well, some of us were. I see what you did there, Walter. And I know you've been secretly crying into your piles of money just waiting for my return. Actually, Walter has been complaining about you more than usual, which is always a sign when he's worried. Don't start, country. Wait, is that? <laughs> and to think the first artifact was taking up dust on the library shelf. Now look at them all. You feel it a bit, can't you? Ever since I found the second one, had the visions. Being around them is just... comforting. So hey, I I'm still not a hundred percent, plus I feel guilty dragging you into all of this. Why don't I stick around and help you get adjusted to the weird corners of the universe? Marvelous. Alright, Barrett, we're gonna play it on, on the crew. Can I put him on the crew? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay. He is my follower. Right. Yeah, Sarah. what is it? Always. Sarah! I'll try, but I doubt any of them. Sarah's not my... But I want to put him on my Anything crew. I can help you with, Captain? I like having Barrett okay, as my follower. Okay, let's go. It's funny as shit. All yours, Barrett. Absolutely. But let me grab my ship Your back. father dropped by. He left a note for you. Here. Want to see what I'm... Ca hey, my dad left a note for me. Sarah. Weapons. Jeez, Sarah. Oh, wait, wait. I'll let you keep all that. I don't see the point in taking it. There you were that. I'll let you keep that on you. The ecliptic pack. I'll take that. that, that.
might be happy. All the way out. All right, anyways. Yeah, so we're gonna call Time it there. Time to go. Sorry about that. I should have probably ended the video before I did all that. But anyways, yeah, we're gonna call it there. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I uh, hope you guys Another continue to enjoy. Another round of invoices it. coming you... in soon, Walter. Never ends. Oh, sorry. Does anyways, it? Let Dare me know I what you guys want to see, for now. what you guys want me to record, progress if you guys want to see more longer afraid. videos, I don't, making I mean, good progress these are days. long already, but of course. if you guys want to see longer videos, I, it's easy for me to do that, I just keep I'm recording. Just um, account, if you guys want to see shorter videos, let me know, do that too. I want to do whatever you guys want to do, and I am, I'm all here for it. This is, this is my first rodeo, and I'm along here for the ride. So, uh, yeah, just give me your feedback, let me know everything. How's the audio? How's the how's the videos actually looking? You know, because I can watch them all day long. I think they look okay. I don't I, I don't have the uh, unbiased opinion someone else would. So uh, sorry about all that. Let me know what you guys think. I hope you guys have a good one, and uh, we will see you in the next one where we will continue off exactly where we left off here for this character. All right, you guys have a great one. I'm out.